Looks like they're going to get it going. Yeah, they, they get somewhat lined up. Looks like a good start. Here we go. Looks like the only driver that didn't make it to the lineup out of the chicane at the green flag was Willie T. Ribs as he lays behind and Davey turn one. Crucial here. Crucial turn. They Are they going to make it? Yes, they are. Wow. Looks good. Everybody makes it through cleanly, but now Right as you go through turn two, this left-hander, wait till you get to turn three. They're going to be, it's a good passing zone and breaking zone. They're spread out. Oh, Yakuman going for the lead Look at right that. off, and he makes it. But he's going to lose it. No, well, yeah. he has the inside. He, oh, another tight turn four here. We'll see who, who gives up. Connor's going to get him. He sure is. So Connor Daly uh, watches Yakuman go from third to first, and then Connor Daly, Davey, back in four, going to swap him right back to the swap lead. Swap him right back now. A tight technical section of this race course, Mike. As you can see, no room for error right here. Very tight to five, six, seven, and here they are back to the pit lane right now. Big bump there, Davey, as we watch Yakuman go over the curbing. This is turn seven. Now they set up for very... Fast part of the racetrack here turns eight and nine. Yeah, new pavement as you can see, Mike. So it's smooth through here. Still need to worry about a little bit of grip as the rubber is not fully down, but uh, it's a nice flowing area. Okay, as uh, the cars are coming to the green flag, here is Yakuman as he moves to the inside. Look at that already oh, banging wow, wheels. Already hitting. <laughs> as he gets together with Peter Dempsey, as Dempsey was trying to get to the inside of the pole sitter, Connor Daly. So and, yeah, Daly just didn't give quite enough room for Dempsey to get between the wall and that car. And uh, luckily, nothing got broken that little incident right there. Xavier, we've, we've got the camera back this weekend. Here's the front straight chicane. Connor Daly working that front straight Look chicane. All, wow. Pretty much all the tires off the ground at the same time. The, the right rear of that car barely touching. But that goes to show you how high those curbs are. And when you hit those things, man, it really gets you airborne. As Gary Airy closes in on uh, Connor Daly for that top spot. But be that as it may, uh, if it does not end up happening for him, I think it's very, very smart for Connor Daly to certainly keep his options right. open by participating in this series on a part-time basis. There's no question he's got the bases covered career-wise. Well, and uh, he's obviously very good. He's having some success overseas. He's having some success here, uh, although you might argue that uh, as uh, Victor Carbona gets inside of Connor Daly, Mark. He does. That's the seven machine of Gary Airy. Gary Airy makes the pass. Carboni still battling it out with uh, uh, Joseph Newgarden uh, for that fifth and sixth spot. So Esteban Gary Airy works his way around his teammate Connor Daly, and he now works his way to P1 in that number seven machine. And that was a great pass. Great pass through that uh, southern portion of the track as Esteban Gary Airy gets around Connor Daly for P1 and top the top position. We've been watching this battle develop. Daly had a 1.3 second lead, one and a half second lead on uh, on Gary Airy, but uh, Esteban, to his credit, continued to chip away at it and now leads this event here in the streets of Baltimore. And he looks like he's threatening to check out, and what that's going no to doubt. do by finishing first, if this holds true to form, that's going to allow him to, to shave some more points off of that advantage that no Joseph Newgarden held. He had knocked it down to 48 points, but again, Newgarden continues to climb. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. That's oh, a problem Daly. for Connor Daly. Wow. How'd that? That's off. Wow. It doesn't, it's off the long straightaway going to the runoff in turn one with, no, that's I'm sorry, in, that's turn three. Yeah. Wow. So, what a uh, strange place for this to happen is Connor Daly. You see him there running right now in the middle, and he just spins Davy. Wow. In the middle of a, of a wide open straightaway. You know, that that's very odd right there, Mike. It's almost like something broke in the back of that car. See his left yeah. rear Well, it's that wobbling. could have been from the wall hit, yeah. though. It's almost like something broke to, to, like a half shaft or something broke to turn him to the right right there because if you were going to spin, it would actually be the other way when you're turning left. And so something had to had to fail on that race car. He, he hadn't even reached his braking point. He, no, he? no, not at all. That was a very odd thing. And I would have to say, no doubt about it, like more than likely a drive shaft. Uh, broke uh, to one side of the, the tire, and it, and it would be normally the right side one breaking, turning the car to the right and uh, and getting in the wall right there. But guess what? Newgard moves up one more spot to fourth so with him going out. And Esteban Garrieri in car number seven during that commercial break. Absolutely unbelievable. I can't believe I, I, we've we seen that happen. And what, what he did, Mike, is he had a five-second lead, basically, or just almost a five-second lead. And he still makes mistakes. We've seen him do it at Long Beach. We've seen him do it every time. Wall, just the kid it is too so tight. fast, so fast. But boy, he just got 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 a, the points championship. Really, Mike. He had over. shaved twenty yeah. points 
off of New Garden's lead, Davey, and was within 48 points with that incident, he is now down 85. 85. It's yeah, all but over. It's all but over. It okay. is all but over. If I'm New Garden, I'm real happy with this. Oh, I'm, I'm very happy, happy with this 14th, right now. Yeah. You're, 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 you know you're the champion. Oh, we, there's that turn three. Yep. Jonas Kasimitz in the hairpin, and uh, Peter Dempsey, it looks like that car is uh, parked there. So here come your leaders through turn number seven. Gustavo Jakobin, Davey, continues to maintain about a four-car length lead over that second-place car of Joseph Newgarden. What a big day for both of these Ab guys. Absolutely. Nowhere to pass in this area right here. That's like I say, if he just gets through there clean, doesn't make any mistakes, he's going to win this race. So here they come beside of Oriole Park at Camden Yards, part of this great downtown, this scenic street course through the streets of Baltimore off of turn number 12 down the final front straight you see the bumps the concrete through the chicane here comes Gustavo Yakuman driving for team more racing from Colombia finally at the top step of the podium the win comes in his 38th career start